<coughs> Rihanna's inside. It's us. Don't shoot. You okay? I'm fine. Just a little winded. Did the guns and sell deliver the mortar rounds? Yeah, but they screwed up. They sent us the wrong ones. No, they didn't. It's white phosphorus. I sweetened the deal. What? You knew about this? What is this bleeding heart bullshit? Guys. We are fu Oh my god. Sentry tower clip me. That's a lot of blood. The beacons. We need to... Whoa, take it easy. We can handle it. You're no good to us dead. He's right. Save your energy for the trip to San Fran. Connor. Uh, take this. It's my badge. Find Arnie, and he'll take care of you. I'll get Boone home, then meet you at the overpass. Guys. You take care of yourselves. We'll be there. Try not to get pulled over. I hope he makes it. It's probably not the first time he's been shot. I know. I'm just saying. He's gonna be fine. These must be the weapons Brooks promised us. Jacobs, find one you like. We'll wait for you outside. The playground. I get it now. We're almost there. The labor camp is at the top of the next street. What's the plan? The front gate should be lightly guarded. We make a lot of noise. Few of them off and draw the rest out of the camp. Then we sneak in the back door. You call this lightly guarded? Stick to the plan. Go loud in three, two. Now, drop! Target down! You got it! Get out of the street! That's how you do it! God damn it, you're a fucking dead eye, Jacobs! We can't take it head on! Find a flank! This way! There's an alley behind this house! Second floor window! for the supply tunnel. We need to be gone before they mobilize. Over here. Hold up a second. 
Sounds like the plan's work. They're sending out a response team. I hate this place. People in here used to be doctors and lawyers. Now they're working the shale mines. Last time I was here, I saw my fucking dentist. Coast should be clear by now. Let's ditch the rifles. We need to keep a low profile. Hang on to your side, Arnie. The sooner we find Arnie, the sooner we get out of here. All right, spread out and ask around. What do you want? You know, you should decide on the capacitors first. Isn't it bad enough I gotta scrape these for my food rations? Sorry, I'm trying to help. Welcome to the Korean vision of America, chickens. That look like recovery to you. You guys are part of the resistance, aren't you? Shut up, Steve. Jesus. What? Sorry, sir. Just ignore my idiot. We don't want any trouble. Trying to get us killed? They're always watching us! Hey, mister, do you have any food? I'm so hungry. Please, I haven't eaten for days. I'll take anything you got. Please. I don't have any food. Piss off. You're not allowed back here. I don't know you from shit. Back off. I'm looking for a guy named Arnie. Fuck you. Never heard of him. Cut the shit. Show him this. Tell him Boone sent us. Hey, Connor, relax. Where's Boone? And who's the new guy? Plan changed. Can you still get us into the depot? Yeah, you know, the administrative buildings. No, no, it has to be where they keep the buses. The tracking beacons have to be nearby. Yeah, yeah, I can get you in, but you have to stick close and do exactly like I say. Follow me. You sure you can get my family out of here? The Resistance remembers its friends. I hope so. I got a teenage daughter. Bad things can happen to a girl in a place like this. You ought to teach her to shoot. Women got just as much to fight for. Are you nuts? No way is my kid joining the resistance. I thought there'd be more guards. They must have heard you coming and split. Very funny. What the hell is this? It's a holding area for the buses, you know, somewhere to wait before your shift at the shale mines. And it's just unlocked. You don't need a key. Don't worry about it. I took care of it. It's what an inside man's for, right? I got kids. Besides, they cut me a better deal. We could have helped you. It's over. Face it. The Koreans won. It's over. It's over for you.
beacons. Then let's get the hell out of here. Rihanna, we got him. Meet you under the highway. I'm on my way. Boone's resting. He's gonna pull through. We'll cut across the baseball field and go through the Elm Street drainage ditch. Come on, it's just up ahead. Hang on to those beacons, Jacobs. The fuel tankers are only gonna be in town for a couple of hours. We're gonna tag them before they leave Montrose, grab a helicopter, and chase them. Just so you know your part in all this. It's just across there. Let's keep going. We should turn back. Thrown into a pit like garbage. How many people are in this ditch? You sons of bitches. Scumbag motherfuckers. You motherfuckers! You think you can just throw us in a goddamn ditch? Sentries! Stay behind the bleachers! Honor's lost it, man. We gotta take out those sentries. I'll burn you, you sons of bitches! We gotta make our way around the field. Get close enough for those towers to toss a grenade. Come get some. I'm gonna make you fuckers pay for this. I'm under heavy fire. Take a good hard look. Jesus, Connor. There's nothing to say. Shit. What do we do? Get in. What? Get in. Hopper, now. Yeah. Come on, Hopper, get up. They're coming. Lie down. What? Lie down! Jacobs, get in! Now!
Ambrose came to me by way of a friend with contacts deep in the resistance. I think we all suspected. No. We knew that atrocities like this were happening, but the proof is so horrifying it's almost surreal. But we should be thankful for this evidence. It reveals an enemy that wants to dehumanize us, but pushing American corpses into an unmarked ditch can't bury our defiance. If dirt and gravel fill silent mouths, we'll speak for them and tell their stories to the world. The dead have names as long as we fight in their memory. The slam will be our land again. Even now, the resistance is planning attacks that can lead to victory in one of our greatest cities. This is the voice of freedom signing off. Thank <laughs> you.